Carpool for School. Welcome to Carpool for School, episode two of the Kate Jones series. Yeah, I've got a question. You know, you've been teaching the UAE now for three years. How have you found that? I absolutely love it. Um, it was a bit tough at first, because I'm from this little Welsh village called <laughs> Hope. I lived in Hope all my life. Um, <laughs> and then it was very different, but now I completely embrace it. Um, I'm a completely different school. Um, really enjoy, but I love both of my schools that I've worked at. Um, this is a through school, so and um, actually I taught year five and six as well, which I'm a secondary teacher, so that was completely new. Um, the UAE itself is absolutely amazing. It's beautiful, Dubai, Abu Dhabi. Um, the network of educators out there is great. <clears throat> Lots of amazing teachers and senior leaders. It's got it's a really exciting time to be in the UAE right now. And you've created something in there, uh, there, haven't you, with the hashtag and everything, and you've built the uh, Twitter community up yeah, there, Yeah, uh, there wasn't really a hashtag for people in the UAE, because it's UK Ed Chat and just things like that. But um, So I created Teach UAE Chat, and then that became a Twitter chat, and we had guest hosts, we've had Tom Sherrington, big fan of. Yeah. Um, we even had an Olympic swimmer, James Goddard, talk oh, about wow. like yeah, fitness in schools. And it's just a way of trying to bring teachers across the UAE together and networking and collaborating but also teachers in the UK to yeah. join up with teachers in the UAE as well it's a bit hard with the time difference yeah sometimes with the Twitter <laughs> chat but you're big in the UAE you know you're big in Dubai you've got a following there so yeah sure two you're... followers <laughs> yeah. and we're very thankful we've got 50% of them in the car now, yeah, so yeah. That's good. yeah yeah so you're happy yeah. mate your hashtags so everyone in the UAE can watch your videos. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was brilliant. And um, with those people that are maybe thinking about doing international teaching, have you got any uh, tips or advice or any myths that you want to kind of bust? Um, yeah, I people? think the best thing you could do, if possible, would be to visit, mm. but that's not always possible, I know. But I did it and it did put my mind at ease, yeah. even if it's just a holiday or visit the school and then speak to people, yeah. you know, send them, find them on Twitter or anything. People send me messages all the time and they might ask me a little bit about a school and I'll try and be as honest as I can. Yeah. Um, but just that little bit of insight and then the myths you said you know yeah. people get very confused like people say to me are you allowed to drive it's like yeah of course you yeah, know I, I, drive, I have loads of road trips and yeah. things like that so you just need to just do your research yeah. look into all areas of the package if you're going with your family as well yeah because different schools they vary some schools give you flights and child places some schools don't yeah. so there's lots to consider but yeah. definitely go for it yeah yeah, yeah. perfect